Hey guys, I just came back from Miami. We went to the this Gator Park Airboat Tours. So, so before I went there, I'm really curious what the heck is that? Like, are we able to see the, the alligator or crocodile or whatever the name you call the animal is and how dangerous that is? And look at this picture and it looks pretty fun, right? So we just booked the ticket and went there. And this is the one we booked. It's called the Gator Park Airboat Tours. And you can buy the ticket here. One thing to notice, you, if you're a national uh, park pass holders, bring that pass holders. Otherwise, you're going to charge $8 per person. So you, if you go there with your friends, like you have six people, you got to pay six, a $48 extra for the ticket. So breaking news. I don't know why it's called breaking news. You have to bring that ticket with you. Alrighty, and and you can buy the ticket uh, where that is. Okay, buy a ticket here, and you can click the button here. I guess you know all this thing. You're not here for this. And here we go. And this is their website called GatorPark.com. Just in case you need to know. And this is the beginning. We are all sitting on the boat, and we need to go through this channel to to be the wide open area. And you can see the uh, the driver can listen like the sound of the driver start the engine. And uh, this long channel actually sometimes you can see the uh, the alligator or crocodile whatever name I just find it confusing sometimes we call it crocodile sometimes you call it alligator. But anyway, now we have passed through that channel and get to the wide open area. And uh, I just hold my stick like a selfie stick high so my camera will get the best view to be honest i am sitting in the middle or sitting on the middle middle of the boat <laughs> and i'm not able to see anything fancy views it's just people in front of me people on the, the side of me and i but because i'm holding this camera i will highly recommend you to get one but before that disclaimer i'm not getting paid by all these companies i'm I bought this by myself from Costco within the Black Friday deals, pre-Black Friday deals to be precise. And uh, yeah, the the, uh, the camera called the Insta360 X3, it, it works pretty well actually. I use it a lot when I don't need to worry about holding the camera angles, I just hold the sticker high. It came, across, came with a uh, Came with a selfie stick that can extend extend it to I guess around 1.5 meters long. It's pretty long actually. And when I came back, I can use uh, the camera to see all this fancy news, uh, the fancy views. Sorry. Uh, yeah, here we go. This is the boat, and you can see this super fast. And there's a one guy, the driver, the pilot, the captain, or whatever the name. He is sitting above everybody else. Look at this. Look at it. He's sitting over there. And he's holding the sticker on using his left hand. But one thing I don't know if you noticed, he is not wearing a safety belt. Look at it. No safety belt. What does that mean? I guess that means the boat is very stable. You don't need to worry about fell over the boat. Otherwise, it's very dangerous. You know what's behind under the knees? What what's behind under the water? That's alligator. That's a dangerous creature. It's gonna eat eat human alive, right? So, when I noticing this guy's not wearing any safety belts, I feel safe. <laughs> uh, yeah, then. Just basically sitting on the boat, and another thing, uh, be careful. The there's no cover on the boat. You're gonna sitting on the boat for, uh, I don't know, maybe half an hour or somewhere around that time range. So uh, make sure to put on the sunscreen. <laughs> Otherwise, look at the guy behind me. Like the guy on the corner, his face is red. I mean, that doesn't looks good, right? Uh, the second tip is, if you go to this tour, make sure don't wear a hat, or you need to wear a hat with uh, something uh, a uh, like a string can 
<laughs> otherwise you get have to hold a uh, hold on the hat all the time uh my friend is wearing one like the my friend hold the, the red hat one we 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 came group and like the the hat is get uh, blow away by this the wind the turbulence whatever this name called it yeah look at this look at this the boat is drifting have you drive sitting on the boat that can drift this is the boat that is drifting that was really cool actually it's super fast the boat is moving fast and i don't know if you have the same question i guess you do i also have the question what if the boat hit hit to the crocodile or hit the alligator what happened how many alligator or crocodile the boat hit Oh, look at this, the drifting. This is so fun. This is so fun. Oh my god, like, look at this. Look at this driver. He's he's enjoying. Oh, he's like, oh, I'm a pilot. These are people just beneath me. I'm uh, taking them to somewhere. I don't need to worry about the boat fell over. Yeah, I mean, this is it. This is it. I mean, you don't see much stuff here. You can see the crocodile. The crocodile is hiding behind some of the water. They probably scare away by this noisy. We have to wear the uh, the the ear ear pod. The noise canceling to make sure we're out. We get we don't get. Oh, look at this! Look at this! So my friend is had to get a blow away by this one. And the driver noticed it. Okay, then he just stopped the engine to make sure it's not a damaged engine, I guess. And all right, so we're stopping here for a while to check around the surrounding areas, see what if 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 we can find a crocodile around us. Everybody is so excited. Wow, it's so nice, so nice. Yeah, that indeed nice. Yeah, look around to see what we can find. There's uh, one animal there. I don't know what that name is. To be honest, I'm not good at this naming stuff. Yeah, this dude gets sunburned like his face is getting red. I mean, where the sun sunscreen. All right, so now it's the uh, photo time. People take pictures. Oh uh, yeah, we're here. And there is an, uh, an animal far away. Look at that on the left side. There's an animal up there. I don't know what that name is, but it's too far away. I, I can't remember the name. I, and I can't even see it clearly. And uh, there might be some alligators or crocodile under this uh, uh, reed, right? And uh, yeah, that's it. I mean, we <laughs> we're literally sitting here like shooting the videos for like 10 minutes <laughs> i guess i don't know how you feel but at the beginning it's fine like five minutes fine but after that it's like, kind of boring like why are we sitting here for so long what are we doing here like there's no animal like there's no crocodiles around us i thought like oh the crocodiles all come along because they're gonna eat us alive but there's no crocodile man that's a little bit disappointing at that time so people say, where's the crocodile? Oh, that's just all the grasses around us. What's what's a big deal? Uh, I guess the big deal is that we are sitting on the boat that is drifting, that's moving so fast. And I haven't done sitting on this kind of boat before. So I guess it's kind of fun. If you haven't, same as me, you haven't done this before, you want to try this first time, I, I guess it's worth it if you want to do that. I. And uh, I guess many people, uh, just like me, sitting on the boat, they try to uh, make the best of their money from this. Huh? And okay, this is the another special function using my camera. I can shoot the like the planet view of the surrounding area. And uh, all right, so we have. Uh, start the another trip. I guess it's a back to the big uh, back to the boarding uh, area. What is that? Yeah, so I'm shooting again, and now this time I 
I find the uh, the boat is moving when when it's moving back, it's it's the same. There's no difference. I'm just joking. There's no difference. <laughs> uh, yeah. Now look at that. This is so fun, right? If you if you're able to sit in the the first row, I guess it's it's gonna be much better experience than sitting in the back because you can see the the water is gonna came in front of your face. And uh, you might be able to notice the boat hitting the alligator, and that would be really exciting. Oh my god, this boat is hitting the alligator. It doesn't matter, but we didn't hit any alligator. Or maybe, I don't know. Uh, look at how chill this guy is. The, the driver is like, oh, I am the king of this area. I know how to do this. And one interesting on uh, look at his uh, right foot. The right foot is on a paddle. I don't know what that is. Maybe it's uh, uh, the breakers to, to slow the boat down. And you can see on this uh, area, there's some area that uh, it's not covered by this uh, grass or this, uh, not grass, cut this reed. So this boat have drive over it many times so they have made up a kind of a road from this yeah like me i can i think you can feel that like you're sitting on the boat for half an hour for this it's like oh i guess like uh, the people in front of me they also get over the excitement already people just uh, what are we doing? We're just on the way back. But one thing I want to say, it's really nice weather, right? Look at the weather. The sky is so blue and the, the sun shines can burn your life. Like it's really heavy sunshine. Like make sure put on the, the sunscreen. If you don't put on the sunscreen, you probably get, get a sunburn after this. I don't know if you notice it, the like the looters in this area. I don't know, but this is the first time in America I see the looters. There's a lot of looters in China, but I don't know you have looters in America. <laughs> but I guess just all for this decoration or this, there are like alligator down there. Nobody will get the looters roots. Like that's a kind of. If you want to collect the looters route, you have to slow down a bit. All right, why we are slow down? Oh, because we we notice uh, an alligator. I have to see the driver have an eagle eye like so far away. The guy say, "Hey, there's a alligator there." I say, "Where that is?" Like everybody looking at the area, the direction like. No, nobody notices until it's very close with the oh there's an alligator. Or oh, crocodile. I don't know how this how do you address that. But some the website called this alligator, but it mo looks more like a crocodile because the crocodile have like a uh, a wider a mouse. Like everybody's, where's the crocodile? Where's the alligator? Where is it? Where is it? Yeah, we're searching the alligator. Where is it? Where is it? I'm standing up. Oh, alligator up there! Where is it? Everybody, where is the alligator? <laughs> uh, can you see the alligator here now? I don't see the alligator. Uh, when I was on the boat, I don't see it until it's very close. Alright, the guy stopped the engine to avoid scaring the alligator away.
on the right. Yeah. But to be honest, man, you are not even looking at the right side. How do you know there's alligator right there? Okay, engine again, you're gonna scare it away. Where's the alligator? I still can't see it. Oh, here we go. There's the alligator. Have you seen it? That's it. That's it. That's the alligator. Please don't stand up. Otherwise, you're gonna eat alive by this alligator. This is a really long alligator. I think it's more than one meter long. The alligator is like, I am taking a nap. What are this food? Why there's so many food come along and they're sitting on the boat? I can't eat it. Go away. I'm sleeping. Yeah. We'll take a photo. Ooh, the alligator is moving. Oh, my food is calm. Where is it? Yeah, throw a meat. That's more useful than call the alligator. I don't think alligator knows human language. Come on, buddy. <laughs> That's how you call the dog, not the alligator. Yeah, this is the one of the event like for this tour if you want to see the alligator i guess they will let you see the alligator they have they know where the alligator is otherwise like how does this guy know this alligator is here like we are literally closer than him to the alligator but we are still not able to see it and i'm holding this camera and you can see the camera is super high right high resolution how do you i'm not even noticing it but he knows ahead of time. I guess he already know where the alligator is. They probably put some food or something over there, so the alligator would go there or eat a lunch, and they they were like they have agreement, they have a contract with alligators. See, hey, you are our employees. You have to come here at this time, and I I need to have my people should take some video of you, take some pictures, so they 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 they're here for you, man. All right, so this is the way back actually, and one thing that really fun is we 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 came across with another alligator, and this one is much bigger than the one we met previously. And I don't know if I have to take a video for the guy. Where is it? Where is it? The guy is holding pointed fingers. Is that it? I don't know. I guess no. Yeah, so this is basically the what this uh, Gator uh, Park airboat tour is. You got to sit on the boat and drifting on the on this uh, wide open area and check out some alligator, take some pictures and get some sunburns if you don't put the sunscreen or lost your hair hat if you're not holding the tight. And that's it.